TSMC's first quarter profits have surged more than 50% this year, but this morning shares of the world's largest contract chip maker showed mixed performance at the Taiwan Stock Exchange ahead of their afternoon earnings call. In Taiwan, with support of the Taiwan government, we plan to build 11 wafer manufacturing fab and four advanced packaging facilities over the next several years. Volume production of N2 is expected to start in second half 2025, and we are preparing for multiple phases of two nanometer fabs in both Xinzhou and the Kaohsiung science parks to support the strong structural demand from our customers. Despite these remarkable profits, TSMC shares have plummeted 20% this year amid growing concerns about U.S. trade policies. President Trump has threatened tariffs as high as 100% if TSMC and other semiconductor companies don't accelerate their American manufacturing plans. Analysts are now closely scrutinizing TSMC's capital expenditure forecast, which will reach unprecedented levels this year. We reiterate our 2025 capital budget is expected to be between 38 and 42 billion U.S. dollars as we continue to invest to support customers' growth. About 70 percent of the capital budget will be allocated for advanced process technologies. About 10 to 20 percent will be spent for specialty technologies, and about 10 to 20 percent will be spent for advanced packaging testing, mask making, and others. Our 2025 CAPEX also includes a small amount related to our recently announced additional $100 billion investment plan to expand our capacity in Arizona. In Taiwan's economy, where TSMC is often called the sacred mountain protecting the country, these growing geopolitical tensions have created significant uncertainty. This uncertainty has led to instability in investment decisions, making companies hesitant to commit to new manufacturing plans due to potential stranded investments. The most concerning aspect of the current situation is the unpredictable nature of protectionist policies, which substantially increases the likelihood of a global recession. This is Dimitri Bias in Taipei for TVBS World Taiwan.